someone. Right there on the bank. Oh well. Right there on the bank. Probably like five, six inches of water maybe. Caught her. Chatterbait. Looking pretty good. If I can get her undone. Nice little chunk. Kid, it ain't a chunk at all. It's just nice little bass, I guess. Maybe 12 incher. Ate the crankbait or chatterbait. So that's good. So we'll get a release on her and get back to fishing. We just got us a good little one on the. Oh, she's bleeding. Must have hooked her in the gill. Well, I think she'll live. But we got a good one on the chatterbait. So. There she goes, she was ready to go. All right guys, I turned the camera off, caught one on the waffle plopper. If you look down in there, you can see some frog legs sticking out of his gullet. A couple little toad legs, so. This is a decent little pound and a half, but caught him on the waffle plopper, so it's great. Let's let him get. That's a nice one. That's a big one, guys. That's a big one, guys. Oh my gosh, guys, this is a monster. Look at that, guys. Look at that fish. That is a big one. I got my scale too. I brought the scale today. And this is a big girl. Oh yeah, biggest topwater fish of the year, I'm almost sure. Oh yeah, look at her. That is a monster. I can fit my fist in her mouth. That is a big bass. About to weigh her real quick. We got the scale right here. I hate to go through her gills, but we have to because it's a uh, I don't have the thing that doesn't go in the gills, the gripper. 5.12. That's a solid fish right there. Solid five. Big old Kentucky bass. Five and a quarter. It's a good fish. We're gonna get some pictures and release her. Uh, get back to you guys in a quick second. Another good one, guys.
another one. Another big one. There we go. Another good one on the Whopper Plopper. This is a small version. We got the scale in the pocket. We're gonna weigh this one too. See what she weighs. She's hooked good. I bet she's about a four, four to five. We'll get back to you guys in a quick second. The day, top water winter bass, spring bass post spawn. Caught her on a Whopper Plopper. Small version, I think that's the 90 series. Another big girl. There she goes. All right, guys, I hate to end the video here, uh, but this just happened, so I'll go ahead and show it to you. Completely, completely birds nested the crap out of it. I guess I had a fray in my line somewhere about 10 yards in, and it snapped 10 yards in, sent my lure flying across the pond. Thank God that it was at the bank where I walk in at, so got the whopper plopper i think and this is a ghost shad coloration is what i've caught caught those two big ones on uh the second one caught by the bank while i was starting to reel it in quick for a recast that's when he hit it second one hit it hit over the brush but this is my whopper plopper got her back gonna go buy some line and i should have brought my other pole i didn't bring my braid pole sadly but we'll be out here again so Hope you guys like this video. I'm, there's, I think there's only three fish in it, but I got some good blow up, so I hope you guys enjoy it. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and like. Share this video, do whatever you want. If you have any ideas of what you guys want to see, let me know. I'll incorporate friends here soon. Thank you guys. This is Tyler and I'm out.